Hello everybody. So we're here tonight to talk about what's going on in our planet right now. We're going through a pretty crazy phase right now. And actually, it's a pretty good time for us to look in ourselves, to look the choice that we make, to ask questions where our belief systems are. Right now, we need to stay home, right? Ordered by the government. So it's a great time right now, a time that is gonna be remembered for many years to come. So use it for your own good. Use it for your evolution. Use it to analyze your choices. What you've been doing. Use it to get out a little bit of the autopilot. Use it to see if your choices are based on what you believe. If you are a spiritual person, your choices is based in your spirituality or your choice is based how much money you make and what can I make this year, what I'm gonna do for money next month. So it's a great time for us to ask those questions because the entire planet is together on this event. Once, less than others, but they are part of it. Everybody is affected by this. So ask yourself, are you a spiritual person? What brought you here? What are you interested in? You're interested in involve yourself as a spirit? You're interested in involve your spirituality? You're interested in ask to answer your questions? Why are you here? Why are you born? So this is a great time right now. And looking at what happened right now, it puts a question mark on us. If this was done by God, or this was by, done by us? It does not matter. There is comp conspiracy over there saying that one guy did it, one government did it, it does not matter. We need to focus on a bigger picture. And the bigger picture is this. The entire world right now is together. It forces to be together. It forces us to look into our neighbors. It forces us to look in what, why we're here. If it's materialism, is the doctrine that we follow, this small speck of life, this virus is destroying this materialism because materialism does not have a foundation on a natural loss. Let's look at the other side. We're here to connect one another. We're here to help one another. We're here not only to love a small group of people, my wife, my husband, my kids, my colleagues, my friends. We're here to expand our love throughout the world. We're here to change a nationality from American, Brazilian, Spanish, or whatever it is, to humanity. We're here to speak one language only, no longer speak English, Portuguese, French, or whatever it is. We're here to speak the language of love. To look that everybody's being affected. The countries that are being affected more, they are being strong. We see on the television, on the news, the volunteer work, the people are getting together to help those cities that have been destroyed by this virus. People paying rent of others. People giving money away, giving food away. People no longer think about the financial future. People think about the humanity, the love that we have for one another. So this, it is a great time. It's a time of reflection. It's a time of changing to know that materialism has failed us. And we only have one thing less for us, our spirituality, our connection to the divine, our connection to love. So with that, I call all you, upon all of you, to think about it. To get out of a little bit of the uh, autopilot and think about life. And think, what is our duty on this planet? It's a great time for this right now. Especially that we are locked down at home. So meditate on that. Meditate in love. Meditate, why is this happening? And the answer will come to you.
Thank you for listening.